What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Sorry if I am a little quiet right now because everyone else is sleeping in my house for the most part. So I gotta be kind of quiet in this video, unfortunately. So sorry guys, but I'm gonna have to be a little quiet. So yeah, this is our final video in our All Rides Week. We're going back to normal next. We're going back to normal tomorrow. We're doing a roller coaster review tomorrow, so yeah, stay tuned for that. That'll be coming out tomorrow at eleven thirty at eleven thirty a.m. Central Standard Time, like always. So we're doing all right, go regardless. Like I said. All Rides Week has been so much fun, guys. I would not be surprised if we do another All Rides Week at some point at, in another state that has a lot of amusement parks. We'll probably do another All Rides Week, All Rides Week in Florida, just to let you guys know. So, yeah. Go subscribe to the gaming channel, Max Space Video Games. Be much appreciated. One subscriber away from 10 subscribers on that channel. We do lots of Roblox videos over there and some other games. So, yeah. Let's get right into today's video. Starting off with our first ride, and that is Apple and Warm Worm. This is a kitty ride. It's one of those worm style rides that there's something in the middle, and the worm is on a track, and it goes around. It's on like a single rail track. And it just spins around kind, kind of fast, maybe like 5, 10 miles per hour. But that's still pretty fast for a kiddie ride, to be honest. And then we have the Artichoke Dip, which is, I, I believe this is their teacup ride by the looks of it. But it's themed to something, can't tell. Oh, I forgot to say, Gilroy Gardens is owned by Cedar Fair, if you did not know that. Gilroy Gardens, Cedar Fair owns Gilroy Gardens. And then next up is Balloon Flight, which is the park's balloon ride. This is one of the bigger balloon rides, not one that Kitty wants. It's one of the bigger balloon rides that you can find, like, at the park's um, Six Rex in America's Big Easy Balloons and Sands Village Amusement Park as Balloon Race. Next up is Banana Split. This is the park's swinging ship ride themed to a banana. <laughs> Very random. And just your typical swinging sh ship ride, but it's a banana instead of a ship. And next up, yeah, Big Red Engine Company, which is a kitty fire truck ride. Then you have the Bon Affe. Railroad, or the, ben, yeah, the Bonifay Railroad train ride. This is the park's train. It's not, it's not one of the bigger trains, but it's still a train. It's still a train. So, yeah. Then you have Bulgy the Goldfish, which is a goldfish ride for kids one of the ones that goes probably like the dumbo style ride possibly this goes up down nice and slowly control control if you want to go up down but that's just that and then we have claudia's carousel which is the park's carousel merry-go-round it is one of the smaller carousels. This carousel is actually really small and it's really old. So, yeah. And then you have Garlic Twirl, which is another teacup ride. They have like two tea. I believe they have like two teacup rides here, but they're both themed to something different. I think Garlic Twirl is a little more intense. Yeah, gar gar Garlic Twirl has a. Throw level of a three. 
Oh, I forgot to say it. Claudia's Carousel is in the kids section of the park. I forgot to say that. Next up, we have the park's main carousel, and that's the Ilian Supreme Carousel. This is the park's main carousel, the bigger one. And next up, we have a Mushroom Swing, which is a wave swinger themed to a mushroom. Very weird. I don't know what to do in regards. It is themed to a garden, so that's probably why. And then you have the paddle boats, which are swan boats. You can find these, you can find the swan boats at many other parks around the U.S. and around the world. So that's very true. And then you have the Paranormic Wheel, which is the park's Ferris wheel. It's not the biggest Ferris wheel, but it's still a Ferris wheel. I'm sure you get some good views still. It's just not as tall as the other big Ferris wheel you can see. This is probably as tall as the ones you'll find at a carnival or something along that line. Next up is Pit Stop Racers, which is a kiddie car ride. Find these all over the place. Save one at Santa's Village Amusement Park. I uh, forget the name of it, but they have one there too. And then we have the Quick Silver, the Quick Silver Express Mine Coaster, which is the park's mine train. Now this one, I forget who it's made by. I know it's not made by Arrow, and it's not made by Vacoma. I don't believe. It's made by some random malfunction. So, yeah. They have a unique mine train roller coaster here. So, I highly recommend you go check it out. Then you have the Rainbow Garden Round Boat Ride, which is a themed river rapids ride. Now, this one you don't get as soaked on as some of the other ones. And this one you get shade. The rapids boats actually have covers on them, which is really cool. Like they've roof, there's a roof above you. It's a, it's really cool, guys. Then we have the Sky Trail monorail, which is the park's classic monorail. It goes right through the greenhouse, and you get some other good views from it throughout the park. And then you have South County Back Roads, which is the park's car ride. I believe they do have antique cars here, but this ride is kind of like cosmic cars that used to be at Cedar Point before they built the Hell Raven. It's a faster ones. Then you have Strawberry Sunday, which I have no idea what that is, so have to research that yourself. Then you have Timber Twister Coaster, which is the park's kitty roller coaster. I believe it's a more of it's more a family roller coaster, and it's one of the ones. With the extremely long trains on it. Kind of like um, Jaguar at Knott's Berry Farm. The extremely long long trains. And some of the other ones you can find at some Six Flags parks. That have the extremely long trains on them. And then you have Tubs of Fun. Which I can't tell what type of ride that is. But it looks like some sort of spinning ride. I'm going to figure out what Strawberry Sunday is for you guys. So hold up. I think it's a kitty spinning ride by the looks of it. That's going to be it for this All Rides video. I had fun doing All Rides Week with you. There might be another one in the future, so stay tuned. All Rides Week was really fun, but we are now going back to our normal schedule. See you next time. Bye.